Welcome back once again, Spazites, to another Transformers video. Today we have a very dusty, bought from Amazon, Autobot Top Shot and Flak. You can see that it's already opened, although it's unopened. <laughs> this is the Autobot Battle Patrol, featuring Top Shot and Flak, and then they combine to form this, which actually has a name. Um, I don't see it. But anyway, <laughs> these are the original paint of two of the figures we got in the 10-pack um, the of MicroMasters. So yeah, let's get down to it. I'm just gonna pull this out. Got the instructions here. Here's our characters. Uh, let's see. I'm going to do a quick little pause and cut them out of those. So, yeah. Alrighty, after what took a lot more time than it should have, <laughs> we've got uh, our Autobot dudes out of here. Um, uh, Top Shot and Flak. Let's see. Uh, Flak and Top Shot. And I'm not sure what their Decepticon mold partners are, but we do have them here for comparison. We've got a darker brown for our Decepticon and a green highlights instead of tan for our for the uh, other for uh, the the other colors. And then for our other Decepticon, we've got a nice dark blue and white. So. They've got all the same articulation as as their Decepticon counterparts. But if I'm not mistaken, they should have different head molds. They do. Look at that. Different heads, which is cool. And uh, I think the chests are the same. But the heads are different, which is really cool. And obviously the paint apps are really different as well. So, yeah, they're really cool. I like them. These are probably some of my favorite molds from this particular, um, all the MicroMasters. I, I love these little military vehicles the best, and they are really cool. They're sturdy molds. They stand up well. They have articulated knees, <laughs> which is something most of the, uh, Weaponizers can't say. <laughs> but, yeah, they're really cool. Or not weaponizers. Micromasters. Um, there is one set of Micromasters. I think it's one of the planes that ha actually has elbows, which is really neat. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get these guys changed into their vehicle modes. And uh, we can check those out. You can see I've got my... Uh, my Decepticon base in the background, which uh, isn't nearly all. I've got uh, Astro Train's uh, launch pad that I can put on there and, and uh, a couple other things that I could put on too, but I just don't have the room to have my modulator, my, my modulator, my, my big modulator base all, all spread out. So, unfortunately, maybe uh, once I get this table cleared off that I'm working on, I'll... Uh, I'll have my modulator base in the background. Anyway, we'll be right back, and uh, all of our guys will be in their alt modes. So, yeah. All right, and here's our little guys in their tank uh, military vehicle modes. Um, just like the originals, we've got full rotation here. I do love the fact that these are all bluish compatible. We got boom like that. And then you might think this one isn't, but it is. Boom. Let's see, where's my matching? Could have sworn I had two of that one. Where is it? Where's the other one? I don't know. Oh, I'm using it. <laughs> okay, I, I do like that color, though. So where's the other one of this? Come on, I know I got two of those. Hmm. Okay, well, uh, let's let's go with uh, the pink then. Okay. 
do kind of have to twist them in a little because it's kind of a snug fit and I don't want them falling out. But yeah, so we've got Bluesh compatible target man or uh, well power uh, <laughs> micro masters target masters power. I don't know what they are called. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, here they are. Um, whoops, like I said, you gotta kind of twist them in. We'll just get rid of this for now and uh, compare them to their counterparts. I, I think I really like, I love this green on this tank as opposed to the tan on this one. Other than that, they're almost colored the same. I like how the, uh, the alt actually got a little extra paint. Although he got extra paint on the sides there. He got extra paint on whatever these are. And then here's our other guy. Boom. Hmm. He's lacking some paint apps. But otherwise the same. He's got his Decepticon symbol here, whereas he's got his Autobot symbol up here. And then these two guys actually have their insignias in the same spot. Notice the Decepticon insignia is just a little bit bigger than the Autobot insignia. Any worry. Uh, yeah, uh, let's go ahead and turn them into their combined weapon mode. I think we flip this out like this, take this like this, and then I think... Does it have to do with that? No, that can't be right. Hmm. I can't remember how this is. Oh, wait, yes. This goes like this, I think. Hmm. Maybe I should look. <laughs> no, that can't be right. Is that the handle? Is that how this weapon goes? No, that can't be right. Hmm. That goes like that? No. Like this, maybe? Hmm. I don't know. Well... <laughs> that just looks stupid. Okay, let me uh, take a quick look at our instruction manual here. And uh, we won't do another cut, because I know this is really easy to do. <laughs> Just not for me, ever. Nothing's ever easy for me. That isn't even the right instructions. This isn't the right instructions. This is the instructions for a set I don't have. Oh, Well, that's disappointing. I've got instructions for Swindler and Road Handler. <laughs> Bummer. Oh, they must have had more than one of these that uh, is out. So it's supposed to look like that. <laughs> so let's um, hmm. boom like that. And then this whole section goes like that. Hmm. That just doesn't look right to me. And then where's where's the Autobot? Oh, the Autobot holds. Okay. This is the, the right way then. Boom. Like that. That's just a big old gun. Yeah, that looks right. <laughs> okay. Once again, we'll throw that away. Uh, this is disappointing. <laughs> Ugh, I don't have that set yet. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, build this other one, too. Just flip it like that. That's all for that. And then this goes out like that. And that goes up like that. Okay, I've already forgotten what to do. Oh, wait, okay. Boom, that go, there we go. And then I find that um, these little stubs get in the way, so you want to put the arms down like this. When you combine it into the weapon mode, that way 
those don't get in the way. So, boom, there we go. We've got our two separate giant guns. One for Autobots, one for Decepticons. So, yay! Unfortunately, like I said, I am missing the uh, right, the proper instructions for this. So, yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, that's it. Thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs> I hope you enjoy my ridiculous videos. One of these days, I might improve, but... I don't foresee that happening anytime soon. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please leave a comment down below. Thumbs up. Hit that thumbs up button. If you really like my video and you're not already, please subscribe. It's completely free for you to do and help me grow my channel. I am slowly approaching 1K. So, yay! Wish me luck. And, uh, yeah. Until next time, as usual, be kind, happy hunting, and goodbye. Don't forget to wash your hands and... If you go out, please be safe. Yeah. Woo. Anyway, <laughs> bye, everybody.